Hello, hello, hello. How are we all doing? Who have we got? I see Alex Blondin. I see Freddy2001. Bella2. Gollum Guy. Uh, over on YouTube, I see Steve Diamond. Laughter, hello to you. Amy Jane, G-Man Legend. Um, Neem, someone. Wittux. 50p Hunter. Laughter, Blue Eggs, G-Man Legend. Daniel M. Hello, Julian. Yeah, Julian's noticed. <laughs> Hashtag Team Red Fez. Still got the Red Fez, but I saw this purple one and I couldn't help myself. It matches my um, shirt. Nice purple. <laughs> it's not blue, it's purple. It's definitely, definitely purple. See, Laughter says purple. Hello, Robert Roberts. Fez is blue. Fez is... <laughs> Neem Wittek says I'm a big fan. Thank you very much. Blue hat, new hat, purple. It's definitely purple. It's definitely purple. Was that some subliminal advertising of your Holy Toledo shirt? I actually, because I haven't worn it for a while because it's been so cold, I've been wearing jumpers on the live streams. I've been wearing it. Um, I was reading through my drawers this morning and I found, I saw, I saw, I saw the blue. And I saw the purple. Now you got me at it in the blue. Hello, Bungle Collect. You were not kidding about the new Fez. <laughs> very true, very true. People are saying blue. Hold on to your hat with the wind. That's right, there's no wind. You might hear wind because um, it's windy and rainy. Hello, Nevin Brad. I'm great, thank you. I hope you're well as well. Well as well, well as well. Bungle, of course, Bungle is team blue hat. Of course, Bungle is team blue hat. He's going to lose the, um, what's it called, this the uh, Paddington team competition this year. He's going to lose the hat. What's that in my head? It's new Fez. It's a bit tall. It's a bit, it's quite a bit taller than the red Fez. For comparison. It's a little bit taller. Maybe that can go on top. Here we go. How's that? A double decker Fez. Double decker Fez. Storm has calmed here in High Wickham. Ah, cool. Well, it has been non-stop rain and gales today. There's, is the hat's lucky charm? Yes. Purple is best, says Denise. There we go. Denise is agreeing. Insert coin big dolt here. <laughs> but yeah. Is there a hat shop in your town? Uh, there's a hat shop in everyone's town. It's called Amazon. <laughs> The old fez was purple. The old fez is red. What coins are you aiming to find? Anything good. Anything good. We could even find um, wrestling without upsetting me as well. We can even find wrestling without upsetting me. How amazing was that? Book almost complete. Two episodes to go. You've got two episodes next week. And then whether we find Kew Gardens or not, we start a new book. Thank you very much, Harry's Nan. I'm glad I'm glad to have found it. The Fez was a plum find. It's purple. Oh, no, now Bungle agrees it's purple. Has Lady M had a word with you? She told you it's purple. Well done on the stream, Christopher. Can't wait for the new book. I know, I can't wait. It's exciting, exciting times. <laughs> the rain in Burton was disgusting. Yeah, it's been hailing a gale. Here, How, howling a gale. Hailing a gale? Howling a gale. It's been ridiculous. Uh, Gollum guy has to go have tea. Well, I hope you have a nice, a nice food. Daniel M said it was plum. Hello, Lady M, and coin cupboard. <laughs> Shut up, coin cupboard. <laughs> the bot team are on hand to answer a common question. So if you guys um, see people asking, "What's my favourite coin?" or "What got me into collecting?" How long I've been collecting? You've all heard the answer to that question a bazillion times um, so I shall leave it out to chat to spam answer those people agreed? agreed? We're a little bit early today just took three minutes to go camera is colour blind quite possibly quite possibly Pantheon Cathedral is my favourite coin <sighs> Alex 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 we'll have words after this 
Hello, Sander Philadelphia. Holy Toledo. Hello, GSA Wolfcoins. <laughs> Hola, I, Amber Weakling. Defo, not Scottish Ryan. What did you think of Tottenham? I do like Tottenham cakes. They are very nice. Very nice. I approve. Oh, Lee Toledo. Uh, dehydrated Pelicans hosting me with the view. Thank you very much. Laura Marsh says, I really hope I win the next giveaway. Well, that'll be up Thursday. Next Thursday. <laughs> Hello, Gary Lawless. Thank you, Robert Rose. I'm glad you like the hat. I love it too. It's great. Hopefully it brings us some 10p luck. Hello, I can levitate. Hello, Tom Potter. Mr. Epic Swampert's. You can, too can, de best. Do you support football team? No, not really. <laughs> James Boy, Jamesy Boy, Jamesy not Jamesy B Hoy. Jamesy B Hoy says, favourite coin, 50p girl guides. Favourite £2 coin, Golden Guinea is going to be my answer for you. <laughs> oh dear. I've let the nutters in charge of the asylum, haven't I? Your new fez looks like IKEA colours, does it? Does it really? Hello, Total Coins. Very good for you, Mercury. Almost got me. Like the blue. It's purple. Hold on. I'll take a picture and I'll post it on, on the Instagram. And you can see. It is definitely. Definitely. Purple. He says. Unsure. Oh, come on. No filters. It's purple. There we go. If you follow me on any of my... Follow me on any of my social medias. We able to see that. Hawkeye? We've got one minute. I just said it's blue, did I? <laughs> well... I haven't had enough coffee. That's the reason. That's probably why. Matthew Whitmore says hello from Wallet. 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 Good start, Christopher. Good start, Christopher. Good. Uh, hello from Warwick. Hello, Dom Collects. Uh, who else? Scott Coins. Hi, Christopher. Bungle. Lady M. And laughter. You missed coin cupboard. You missed coin cupboard. Hello, Master Temple. He ho he ho to you. Uh, GSA Wolfcoin says, Hi Christopher Clicks, can you give my grandson Kobe a shout out? Hello to you, Kobe. Thank you for watching. Shout out to you. I'm being weird today. <laughs> what a comment. I just got I got my I got my um my words in a muddle. My words in a waddle. Luckily Christopher's good at sorting coins. Exactly. You're not here to listen to me talk, are you? You're here to have a look at some coins. So it's six o'clock. Books. Books, 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 books are under the desk. 2018 first. So the 10 P's. Down a bit. We are so the uh, 10 P's. We are looking for the alphabet. This was in focus. Now it is. It's kind of. We'll battle along with that. So we've got. We've got to fix this. We've got to fix this. We can't just look at this. This is going to drive me nuts. Did I, oh, I must be holding it closer when I was adjusting the focus. What a bonehead. Bear with me, chat amongst yourselves a moment, whilst I faff around. I leave Bungle in charge for a moment. Come on, fat fingers. Ooh. There we go. So, we've got... In 2018, we've got B, C, G, L, M, and I, N, Q, P, R, and S, X, Y, V, T, and U. 2019, on the other hand, 2019, on the other hand, get out of my face, 
All we've got is E, G, and F. L, K, I, and H. Nothing on that panel. Empty panel. Uh, X and V. So work to be done there. What's the hat a symbol of? So when I was in Tunisia last year, Frankie Franks, who may appear on the stream somewhere, uh, told me if I came back without a fez, he'd be most disappointed. And as a joke, I wore it on the live stream when I was back, and I got really good luck. And now I've got to wear it every week to make sure I get the luck. That is what the fez is all about. Hello, UK Coin Hunt. Hope you are well. Official game wants a shout out. There you go. Hello, Jamie lad. Ready for Christmas? Find a cube. That'd be great, wouldn't it? That would be great. Not sure if I'm feeling the blue. It's purple. Purple. The chair's blue. The hat is purple. We're going to see if it brings us some 10p luck. Very funny, Freddie Mercury. Very funny, Freddie Mercury. Not going to get me. Where'd you buy your collection books? I buy them from eBay. The chair's blue. Something top is purple. The hat is purple. The hat is very, very purple. Purple is my colour. Right, let's see if we can get some luck. Oh, we've got something already. We've got something already. What have we got? We have got Guernsey Tomatoes 2012. Very, very nice. Well, we've got, we've got to find. We know it's not going to be a big bust. That is always the concern. But it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Tomatoes. Yeah, yeah. Moving on swiftly. Is it really Freddie Mercury? Well, I'm not going to say that because it will it could potentially send. I'm going to way too far on this jacket. It is boiling. I'm going to burn up in here. What's the most you found on a 10p hunt? I think four, five. Five is probably the best. Edo Buzz loves the channel. Thank you very much. Everything feels a little bit forward. Let me just. Hmm? Ooh. Just move everything back a little bit. Everything back a little bit. There we go. Let's see what cracking finds we're going to find. Great, you got the wrestling 50p for the book. I know, I was so chuffed to get that. Over the moon. Now we've only got two episodes left to find the Kew Gardens. And who knows? Well, I know, but. <laughs> Love the t shirt. Thank you very much. Available on my Teespring site. Do you recheck the coins after you stream to see if you missed something? Uh, no. I mean, I go through the, the 50 bees looking for the key dates. But other than that, no. Holy Toledo. Have you missed anything? We got Guernsey Territories 10p. Rather have toe hand than no hand. Huh? What? Wah, 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 wah. <laughs> I think I missed half a conversation there. Hello, Zotty Moon. I hope you are well. Ooh. 
Oops. Jamie Lads, off to the Royal Mint in April. What else do you recommend to do in the area? We are there for a weekend. I'd recommend staying in Cardiff. There's plenty to do in Cardiff. Although I did upset someone that lived in Clantrissant by saying there's nothing to do in Clantrissant. <laughs> I got the breaks of 50p. Yeah, I got the strike on the day, the strike your own, and I got one of my change at the Royal Mint. But my bunk and silver proof have not appeared yet. <laughs> Favourite tree, what a bonkers question, I know. <laughs> it was a good question there, Dad. It was a good question. It gave me a chuckle as well. Found a bird Gibraltar 1P. Well, how much is it worth? Who knows? Not me, that's for sure. I'm not a walking, talking stockbroker of coins. Neem Mutak says, can I have a Q Gardens? I really want one. Well, yes, keep looking then. The only way you guarantee you'll never find one is if you give up looking. Have a look. See that, Alex? It's a 2017. I thought that's the side. Alex was looking for 2017 10 pences and couldn't find any. And I think they're quite common. <laughs> Not that he watches the 10Ps. Can you please... Uh, leaves? Can you please give a shout out to my son Jake? Hello Jake. Massive... Um, massive... Massive backlog. Goodness gracious. Massive backlog on the Bunks Brexit nightmare. Mm. Have you not had yours either yet? A UK coin hunt. It's been over a week and there's no sign of mine yet. Hello, Lynn Mills. Hello, Purple Fairy. <laughs> no, I cannot fit to be Hunter. Oh, there's another one, Alex. Did you see that? Two. Look at that. That's oh, just very corroded. Not in a very good state. So what's everyone else been finding then? I think everyone knows what my star pull of the week was. What's everyone else's star pull of the week? Alex Chantel Powell says, watching whilst awaiting dinner. Mm. Julian found sailing 2012. Ooh. Pretty much, I got my favourite coin. Really? Bungle Collects found two Olympics this morning. I saw. I saw. Hello, the Honey Monster. Thank you very much. God, this bag is idiot proof. It'd be great if you could give my YouTube a shout out. It's called Kian Collects. And my goal is to get 50 subscribers. There you go. Speaking of shout outs. Bungle, 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 Bungle is rapidly approaching 1500 subscribers and has a cracking giveaway. So Bungle, if you'd like to post a link to your giveaway video, go for it. Ah, Caledonian Coins, yo, munching on food, catching up with the stream, have you missed much? Uh, we found a Guernsey 10p. You're not normally on this early, what's going on Caledonian? What's going on? Hello, Katie Hall. Just realised 40k, I know. Yeah, 40,000 subscribers was that last week, wasn't it? Bonkers, absolutely bonkers. Hence, 
Thursday's video is going to be a bit of an insane giveaway, so be sure to t be sure to stay tuned until Thursday. I'm a bit further away than I usually am. So excited. It's going to be a good giveaway. You guys are going to love it. There are no giveaways. Stop believing those things. All they care is their view count and subscribers. I view those giveaways as me giving back as a thank you to people that subscribe to me. And there, there are giveaways, definitely. I do giveaways quite often. So, zip it. <laughs> Obviously a long time viewer. Have you ever bought a Strike Your Own? Uh, other than the ones I've gone to the Royal Mint to buy, no. Although the very kind coin cover did send me one. The Isaac Newton Strike Your Own. But I sent him back one of the Strike Your Owns I had as a spare. Could you do a 1200 coin haul giveaway i don't think i could stretch that far <laughs> i'd be left without a float if i did that much of a giveaway although the forty thousand subscriber giveaway prizes are pretty nice holy toledo we've got a pigeon alert pigeon alert from ah that's Elizabeth McQuaid. Sorry, Katie Hall has super chatted £1.99. Thank you very, very much. Elizabeth McQuaid, have you contacted me yet about the snowman giveaway? Uh, speaking of there being no giveaways, according to some numbnuts, Elizabeth is the win was the winner of the snowman giveaway. So big congratulations. I'm sure you'll all join me in congratulating Elizabeth. I'm assuming she's seen the video. <laughs> that wasn't a nice comment you had then. Good job. You have many more supporters than is yet. <laughs> you sent me a message on Messenger. Cool. I will check my messages after the live stream. Because I'll have to verify you that, that you are you. Do you want a silver pound coin? I, uh, I think Caledonian Coins sent me a silver pound coin. I've got one. Um, I'm focusing on two pound coins at the moment. And if I find one that's going for a really, really good price, a 50p. But I'm sure in time I'll circle back to the pound coins because the silver one that Caledonian Coins sent is an absolute stunner. Holy Toledo! Hello, David Hansen. Holy Toledo. Spend a penny has donated a pound over on Twitch. Thank you very, very much, Spend a penny. Spent a pound. Oh, look at that. That is the Technicolored Dream Coin, isn't it? Wowee. What are we looking for? I shall show you in a moment. So the 10 Ps, woo. Every left of the alphabet has something quintessentially British. They were released in 2018 and 2019. They're quite elusive, so it's a good job to find any of them. So, for example, you've got three there. E for English breakfast, G for Greenwich Mean Time, F for fish and chips. So we're looking for any letter of the alphabet, any letter. And then also there's territories like that came from Guernsey. That's kind of interesting. Nightmare coin, more like. Yeah, <laughs> I just agree. It had to be a good old lion rampant, exactly. Speaking of giveaways, please subscribe to Bungle Collects Coins. Here is the link. There we go. Bungle has posted the link over on YouTube. If you haven't entered his giveaway, go on over. Let's get him to 15,000 subscribers and um, get that giveaway done. Uh, Woody UK found an offside 50p on Friday. Wowee, what I could find. Do I watch Doctor Who? Nope. I watched the first season of the revamp with Christopher Eccleston. I was quite young then, but other than that, I haven't. No, I watched the old Christmas special if it's on.
15,000? 15,000 watts. Shout out to King Kong Ash. He just started his channel for collecting coins. Good luck finding any A to Z coins. Well, my fingers are crossed. My fingers are crossed. Can you say a big happy birthday to my daughter, Millie Roberts, four years old tomorrow? Well, happy birthday to Millie Roberts tomorrow. Four years old. I have a lot of old one pound notes in a sealed bag. Do you think they're worth any money? Uh, it depends which variant it is. So like the Somerset, Somerset pound notes, I think they're called. I have an awful lot of, they're available on my website if you want to buy any, www.christophercollects.co.uk. I've still got a fair few of them. A lot of uh, sequential ones. Uh, Raff, Raffian Trash says, I have an ice cream 10 pence. Very nice. That's a very, it's an awesome design. It's, a, it's in my top five. Found a mint condition 2011 Olympics volleyball last night. They're usually rough these days. Ooh, very nice. Any Olympics are nice find. Ho, lead to lead <laughs> Jamesy boy has, has super chatted £2.99 and says, today's hunt is sponsored by Ribena. <laughs> We're very purple today, I granted. Do you have the Stephen Hawkins 50p? I do. I've got the bunk and the silver proof. Very cool designs, one that I really, really like. Your hat is cool. Thank you very much, Andrew. Strawberry Ribena. <laughs> Purple Fairy wants a plug. Uh, Purple Fairy has a giveaway. Very cool. We'll have to take, out, take, a, take a look at that. So head on over to Bungle and Purple Fairy. Fez is looking a bit more purple now. Ah, colour changing. It's a chameleon fez. Chameleonic fez. Leave one with like um, strobe lighting for when we find a really good coin. <laughs> like we're at a rave. I traded one pound coin for Olympics basketball 50p. Do you think it was worth it? Definitely. As long as it's not like an uber rare pound coin or I don't know, sort of like a trial pound coin. Or the Edinburgh old round pound. But spending a pound on, a, on an Olympic is pretty good going. Elaine Vines says, I like the coin collecting community. It's a really nice little community we've got going. All the other coin tubers as well. It's a nice little corner of the internet that we've got. Taking a break from clearing out my flooded cellar. Holy Toledo. Well, I feel for you, Martin Ross. I hope that that gets resolved quickly. Okay, Alex, there's another one. I'm not even looking for them, but I found three. Three. And there's number four. For those of you that tuned in a bit late, um, I'm not keeping the 2017s. I'm purely winding up Alex in the chat because he can't find any. <laughs> um, I thought about becoming a coin tuber. Go for it, Julian. Why not? A new fez? Yes, Jono. New fez. What colour is it, Jono? No one tell him. What colour is it? If you get it wrong, you're not allowed to voice chat this evening. Crash bang wallet. The lid of my bin flying away. Hello, the coin collector. 
<laughs> Alex says orange. Alex isn't loud in voice chat tonight. I doubt it's 50p going into circulation. I highly doubt it. But I'd quite like to be pleasantly surprised. Whoops. But I would assume not. Last Temple says green. I'm colorblind. <laughs> John, says purple. There you go. You're allowed on voice chat. John, I got it right. Wait, would that be blue? No, it is purple. Lady M says, we're getting lots of 2017s. Our post office had a hundred pound bag of them. Wowie. Should have taken a picture of it and sent it to Alex. <laughs> do the Wallace and Grabber coin? I do. I got the Strike Your Own, the Bunk, and the Silver Proof. Very cool coin. Colouring coin says, I got a sealed bag of 2019 20Ps today. Wow, eh? Oh, we got something. It's a foreign coin, Hungarian. Um, 2006. 10 foreign. Not quite 10p. What's what's 10 foreign equivalent of then in sterling? It's probably all of about two pence. Do you have any coins from Bangladesh? I've got a few. I get them looking through my world coins on the world coin hunts on Sundays. Two pieces, Peter Booth. Is that how much the 10 forints is? Been cheated out of eight pence there. Egghead. <laughs> in my wrestling. Thank you very much. I was really chuffed to finally find it. What exactly are we looking for? Well, I shall show you. So every left of the alphabet has something quintessentially British stamped on it. So you've got L for Loch Ness Monster, K for King Arthur, the Knights of the Round Table, I for Ice Cream, H for Houses of Parliament. So 26 varieties issued in 2018 and 2019. That's what we're looking for. We'll also look for territories coins from the Isle of Man, the Isle of, uh, Jersey, Guernsey, uh, Gibraltar, Falkland Islands. And then if we get any world coins like that 10 foreign, we've, I've found US quarters before. List of suggested Fez colors, colors a blue, a purple, blue, green, red, orange, and plum. There we go. Are you going to change deck a live swap in Cardiff? I thought it already happened, hadn't it? I think it's midweek though. I think they're going midweek. If it's over a weekend, I'd be tempted, but it's midweek. I can't get down there, unfortunately. Have you ever been to Guernsey? If not, would you like to? I haven't. Uh, I'd like to get to, to all the different territories, but um, Guernsey is not the top of the list. That's got to be the Isle of Man, followed by Gibraltar. Twenty-five pieces, Robert Roberts. Is that what the ten forints worth? That's not bad. <laughs> February the nineteenth. Uh, ten days. So no, I won't be able to make that. Unfortunately, if it's midweek. Unfortunately, I work Monday to Friday. Not a lot I can do. Oh, Alex, look. There's another one. Am I going to start collecting fezzes? <laughs> Could you imagine it? If there's one thing my life doesn't need, it's another collection. If 
Hello UK Coins Forever. There's another one, Alex. Anything good yet? We've found a Guernsey 10p and a Hungarian 10 forint. No alphabet 10ps yet. I had a bit of a dry streak on them, haven't I? Got Christopher to ban this guy. He's doing my head in. Who's that? If he says my name, I'll go away. Then that just perfectly sums up the internet trolls. I didn't, I, I must admit, I didn't see. I didn't see. I'm sure the moderators will have dealt with them swiftly. What's up with 2017 shields? Uh, I'm not keeping them. It's purely because uh, Alex is in the chat. Can't find one. And he mocks me for finding, trying to find, re trying to get me to find a wrestling and a comedies and uh, Commonwealth Games Wales on the live streams. But I need them for my books on YouTube. The YouTube weekly, uh, daily videos. Um, so I'm, I'm a little bit of a wind up this evening myself. <laughs> Probably need to get a life there just sad. 100%. Some guy said, said to you, if he says my name, I'll go away. After a bunch of troll lines, I got deleted. There we go. Went through money pot and found a 1953 half penny. Cool. Hope you find the Commonwealth Games Wales as penance for my sins. <laughs> Amazing. Oh, there we go. Alex, there's another one. Oops. We're doing this. Alex is rage quitting coin collecting now. Well, you got my PO box address. <laughs> Hello everyone, hope you've come safely through the storm so far. I, I, I think I went out once and that was to go get some fabrics often from the garage. Other than that, I've stayed indoors. Right, last bag of these 10 Ps, and then we'll be moving on to 50 Ps. Good price for a snowman strike your own. Ooh, good question. I'm not 100% sure, because I've not, I've not had to look at the prices of them, to be fair. I'm sure someone in chat will know. Maybe bungle, maybe laughter. Hands getting manky, I know. Coins are disgusting, aren't they? I think any of us that have worked in retail will attest to that. The bungle collects magic studio nearly, nearly blew off in the wind. <laughs> Amazing. Fabric softener from pump one. Not that kind of garage, not that kind of garage. <laughs> Not on a four chord. Alright, these are the last few. There we go. Well, sadly, no alphabet 10 Ps, but we did get a Guernsey and a Hungarian 10 forint. The Guernsey one is very, very shiny, isn't it? Very cool. And then we got all these 2017 10 Ps just as a bit of a wind up. The mint should make all capital cities of the UK's. Yeah, it was on the one pound, the old round pound. You have the Edinburgh, um, 
Edinburgh, Cardiff, London, and Belfast. Belfast? Dublin. No, Belfast, isn't it? Have you got every strike you're in since Frankenstein? Uh, I have every Frank every Frankenstein since... Every strike you're in since Isaac Newton, because that was the one prior to Frankenstein that CoinCover very, very kindly sent to me. Need to go to the Royal Mint. Sell it to me. Hey. Uh, pass. Robert's found a 2018 one pound coin that looks like it's got an extra stem at the bottom, bottom end of the clover. Oh, cool. Send me a picture. I'll take a look. Uh, will these coins go in value or down as time goes by? Uh, as I have a collection myself, I've got no idea. I would imagine they go up, but I'm not collecting for as an investment or anything. Arqua says, I live in Germany and here the storm is still growing in force. Really? Wow. Uh... £25 is a good price, according to Bungle. Gen C. Storm is finished where Julian is. Chris from 39k to 4.4k in just a few weeks. Wow, I know, it's bonkers, isn't it? Leah Morris wants a shout-out. There you go. When is the next time you're going to the Royal Mint? Uh, March the 7th. And Bungle will correct me if that's the wrong date, because <laughs> I keep forgetting what date it is. Right, I'm going to go wash my hands because they're grim. I should be back in a moment. And we're back again. We'll do 50 piece next. We'll be here till Christmas at this rate. Here till Christmas till what? It's got a bit it's still a bit windy down in Nottinghamshire, but the worst is gone now. Hello, unlucky disclaimer. Well done, Stephen finding a gruffalo. Stephen found a gruffalo. Very nice. Vape time, yes, vape time. <laughs> so I vape, you shouldn't vape. Don't smoke, don't vape. You'll die immediately, so don't do it. And yes, Bungle and Kid Hill, I vape. Hello, Condemore UK. Finally have electric and internet back after eight hours. Oh dear, eight hours of no electric and internet. What did you all do? What did you do? Back to the red fez? Yeah. We'll go back to the red fez for the 50 Ps. We've got to find a Kew Garden somehow, haven't we? <laughs> TM Coins played hockey in the storm. Wowee. <laughs> Master Temple says you played Ice Spy all day. <laughs> See, Christopher is immortal as he doesn't die immediately from vape. <laughs> exactly, Molly. Exactly. The blue fez is unlucky. Uh, the blue fez is, a, I think it's, that's the 10p fez. We'll call it the 10p fez for now. But 50p's, where's the book? I'm really get out of my face. Where's the book? The book is, that's two pounds. The book is, here, 
So what are we missing the 50ps then? We are missing Q Gardens. We've got almost a whole page of Olympics there. Missing Bungle's favourite, Olympic football. A nice one to find. We've got the one I reckon Absolute Coins is going to get stuck on, Olympic Gymnastics. We're missing Triathlon. We've got Wrestling in this book, so we're not going to be stuck on Wrestling in this book, that's for sure. We've got Puddle Duck, Isaac Newton, Flopsy Bunny. I know Flopsy Bunny's on the next page. Flopsy Bunny. Paddington the Tower. No Brexit coin yet. Who knows, maybe today will be the first Brexit coin I find in a bank run. Amy has a gymnastics, the only Olympic coin you have. Very nice. My favourite Olympic, to be fair. What's this? Uh, this is book one for the live streams. Book one for the live streams. Let's see where this comes up to. Oh, sorry, I've got no space. Uh, David SCC UK wants. Shout out, there you go. Can you say hi to the Twitch viewers for, for us? Says Laughter. For those of you on Twitch, Laughter says hello. On behalf of those watching on YouTube. Can we see the Stephen Hawkins? Stephen Hawkins is stashed away at the moment. Don't have it to hand, I'm afraid. But I did make a video on it. So if you search Christopher Collect Stephen Hawkins, I'm sure you'll find that video. Uh, we've got, so Britannia will be looking for the years 2008. Shields are looking for the years 2009, 10, 11, 16 and 18. Which is not instead of circulation. But also the year 2017 is a low minted year. That's a nice first find. Peter Rabbit from 2016. Slightly over face value. Very nice. The whole 2016 set, with the exception of Tiggy Winkle, is over face value, I'd say. A coin pig's joined. Hello, coin pig. Coin pig will be with us fully shortly. Ooh, we got a 2018 there. A very, very shiny 2018. What do we reckon? What do we reckon? Holy Toledo. Harrison Orr has hosted my stream with the viewer, viewer over on Twitch. Thank you very much, Harrison. What do we think then? W.H. Smith's so expensive for everything. People are saying people act patterns at the station. Did I call it the blue fez? It was purple fez. Purple fez. I'm sure I said purple. People act Taylor of Gloucester, Taylor of Gloucester, Paddington Station. Looks flashy, it does, doesn't it? It's going to be a nice one. Hopefully it'll be a Flopsy Bunny. Ooh, it's a Taylor of Gloucester. Who got it right then? Harrison Orr. Master Temple. Uh, itchy itch Richie. Itchy Richie. <laughs> That's a good find. A keeper for sure. We've had no 2019 Paddingtons yet. The battle still rages. Although, I did watch Bungle's most re recent 50p video. And you seem to be a bit... Um, Unsure. Please sort my tassels out, excuse me. <laughs> so is Bungle wavering? Is Bungle wavering? Just because I changed the feds. <laughs> Grocery Coin Hunt says, I went to the post office and said, can I have some 50ps? He immediately exclaimed how he had no new Brexit ones. I can imagine that they are getting a lot of people asking for coins, for that for that coin. Finally wrestling, exactly. Watch my next 50p video next Friday. Mm. I don't know, I think, I think, I think, um, Time will tell, Bungle. Time will tell. We've got Benjamin Bunny. Very, very common. Pop him over there. 
Everything's just a bit lower down than it usually is. What's going on? You'll see sense bungle. You'll change size before <laughs> before the end of it. Hang about, hang about. We've got a 2011. What's it going to be? What's it going to be? Hello to you again. Third week I've tuned in. Uh, just say I have Roman. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Messages are flying in. We've got guesses. Box, botcher, wrestling, wrestling, archery, archery, football, wrestling, wrestling. Holy Toledo, Addo Buzz has super sub two pounds. Thank you very, very much. Football, cycling, sailing, cheese, wrestling, 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 sailing, not football, says Bungle. Please, not football, says Bungle. Uh, taekwondo, offside rule, archery, archery, rowing, rugby. Triathlon, wrestling, swimming, basketball, uh, gymnastics, rugby, football, cycling, swimming, wrestling, football, apple bobbing, dwarf tossing, archery, pigeon alert from Adobuzz, says Coin Cupboard, triathlon, wrestling, triathlon, football, 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 <laughs> everyone wants it to be football, I would kind of want it to be football as well, it is boxing, it's a very nice one, very cool, any hunt you find an Olympic on, is a successful hunt in my books. Bungle can breathe a sigh of relief. Cat taming. <laughs> Two men poking each other. Floorball. Wheelchair swimming. One bloke fighting. How do I get my coins? I get them from my bank. I've got a business account there, which makes a difference in some places. I also had to buy a new suitcase this week because my other suitcase, uh, one of the wheels fell off <laughs> and another wheel imploded. So that was fun. Vegan swimming? Do I play Fortnite? I don't. I've never played it, no. I gained a 2019 pattern to 50p from a hungry horse. Huh? We got Mrs. Tiggy Winkle. Very, very cool. Whoops. Not send everything flying, shall we? Olympic Rocket League. Oh, we've got dictionary there. Very, very common though. One we see an awful lot of. Oh, I see another Olympic there. There's a Sherlock Holmes. I really made a hash of sorting these out. I don't know what's going on. It is Olympic canoeing. Wow, two Olympics. Holy tilly day. I think Tiggy Winkle is lower minted than 2016 Peter. Is it? Can you say Bald Martin is a god? Okay. There we go. Olympic number two. Very nice. I'm two off of completing my 50 piece set, and that's Q and Jemima Puddle Duck. Well, good luck. I hope you find it soon. I hope you find them soon. Jamesy Boy says he can't be God because he because Jamesy Boy is. Oh dear. What have we started? What have we started? The Crimson Fez is back, it is. That one in the middle. Nothing. Favourite cheese? Uh, I quite like chilli cheese. Not too spicy though. It's like a little bit of a kick. It's nice. If you find Q, it's mine for 50p. I don't think so. I don't think so. Do I have to register my, register my business to open a website? No. I did have a business registered by that point, but no. Do 
Do you have any Olympic footballs? Please say yes. I haven't found one in a long, long time. I've got my fingers crossed. I just want to beat Bongo to it. <laughs> Q Gardens or Q10P? Uh, Q Gardens, I'd want. That's what I'd pick. Who's my website host? I'm not sure. I can't remember. We've got the UK's entry into the EEC here. That's a nice find. I have face value. Jeremy Fisher. Whereas Bungle and Coin Cover calls him Toad Boy. Even though he's a frog. There we go. Ooh, there we go. Our first Paddington, of course, is Paddington at the Cathedral. The one that you're more than likely to see tons and tons and tons of. Um, according to my um, sample. <laughs> Team Cathedral. You're going to lose. Give in now. Oh, we got another Taylor Gloucester. Very nice. Team Tower, exactly. We're going to win. We were, I was right with the Flopsy Bunnies. Going to be right with the Paddingtons. It's going to happen. Master Temple says 10 million of each. Oh dear. Master Temple smells of creosote. Sitting on that fence. We've got a people act there. Very, very common. Favourite Star Wars film? Return of the Jedi. 100% Return of the Jedi. We've got Scouts there. Another common one, but it's a cool design. I like that one. Oops. Empire was much better. I've always preferred to return the Jedi. Oh, we've got another Jeremy Fisher to start this bag off. There we go. It's 2014. So it was a 2011 for a second there. I saw a brief, a brief glimpse of it. Holy Toledo! Pokey Phil. 99 has joined the hunt over on Twitch. Thank you very, very much. Favourite Star Wars droid? Uh, oh, C-3PO. It's got to be C-3PO. John Rudy says, I'm a late again. What have you missed? Uh, the 10 Ps we found a Guernsey and a Hungarian. The 50 Ps we found two Olympics. UK's entry into the EEC. And patterns at the Cathedral. There's our second 2016 Peter Rabbit. Very, very good. Do I do swaps? No, not really, no. It just takes too much of my time. And the problem is that I've got everything in UK change. At least once. 2017's Peter Rabbit, leaving us just old Crazy Eyes himself to find them. We completed that set. Oh, there we go. That's one that we want to see. Flopsy Bunny. How cool is that? Obviously, alphabetically, the rarest 2018 Beatrix Potter. Unarguable, that point. Even Bunker would agree with me on that one. That's the uh, that's the Beatrix Potter you want to see. C three P are you mad? R two D two. Twenty seventeen. It's another Peter Rabbit. Oh, 
What do you think of the new £20 notes? I think they're cool. I've not had one yet. Which is Holy really Toledo! Test, isn't it? It was like the, the 2019 Paddington's. I wasn't a massive fan of when I saw the designs, but when I actually had some in my hand, I thought they looked quite cool. Do I like pizza? Yes. Love pizza. Uh, why would you say that when they're both the same vintages? Ah, oh, Chalky Garden. You're going to get splinters the same as um, Master Temple. The Cartel Boss has joined the hunt over on Twitch. Thank you very, very much. We've got girl guiding there. Very, very common. We've got Ironside. Cool design, but again, very, very common. Oh, I've just seen coins to collect joining in. Thank you for tuning in. He's enjoying Picard. Oh, I'm, I'm enjoying that too. I think there's, what, three episodes are out now? It's a bit of a slow start, but I'm enjoying it. There we go. Our first Paddington at the Tower. That's the one you want to see. That is the one you want to see. One guy says, I like collecting, but your hands smell nasty after touching coin. Oh, agreed. That's why you should always wash your hands. I used to like passing the tabs. Sick of looking at them now. There are too many of them. C couldn't disagree. Hello, Wendy Fletcher. Card Trapdoor. As the show that I used to watch the kid, I'd love to see Trapdoor on 50ps. There's another tailor of Gloucester. Holy Toledo. We've got three tailors of Gloucester. Wowie. We've got Commonwealth Games. Another common one. What percentage of Olympics is still in circulation? I have no idea. Not a clue. Having a bit of a breakup in the stream. Oh, I see. <laughs> this must be the storm. This must be the storm. Holy Toledo. Bobby John 66 joined the hunt over on Twitch. Thank you very, very much. Unfortunately, there's little I can do about the weather. Thanks for coming back to life again, though. Need a city show on a coin. I haven't done that yet, but that's a good idea. We can weather the storm. <laughs> We're going to lose you in a moment. Oh dear. Do you have the Queen five pound coin? I do. Audio went so stuttery. Uh oh. It's okay. Didn't you have a purple hat earlier? <laughs> oh dear, yeah. Let me see if refreshing the stream does anything. Da, 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 da. Now that I've refreshed it, it looks okay. There's another pattern to the tower. Very, very nice. Always happy to see one of them. If it's breaking up for you, try reloading the stream because it's that's worked for me. Probably the weather is a bit frightful currently. On YouTube and Twitch, look here, everyone. There you go. It's just a glitch in the matrix. A bit dodgy. The breakup in the stream makes your fingers look even more dirty. Oh dear. Right. Um, we just see how it's going for a moment. I might end and restart. See what that does. Pop these coins in the middle where they are visible. Back. Moment.
Can you hear me? Hello? Hello? Mm, it's still looking a bit funny. It's still looking a little bit odd. Picture's okay. Yes, we can hear you. It's good now. He's back. Mm. Hopefully, it stays like this. But unfortunately, there's little I can do about the weather. We've got Benjamin Bunny. <laughs> Not now, stream. <laughs> Unfortunately, I have no control of the weather. Some time collect. Well, hopefully. Oh god, it's gone very fuzzy all of a sudden. Yeah. Did I say something earlier about a new fez? I did. Yes. You may take our stream, but you'll never take our fez. <laughs> it all went mental, Mickey. Back to normal now. <laughs> Everyone like this stream or your house will flood. Oh dear. We'll persevere, we'll see if it gets... Ooh, hang on. Talk about it has been flooded. There we go. Am I in Jersey? No, I'm not. Did I see Wedge and Tilly's cameo in The Rise of Skywalker? I did. I had a big grin on my face when I saw him. That's a cracking find, though. Does anyone know what the coin will be on Strike Your Own on the 13th? I think it's going to be the VE Day anniversary. But we've got an Olympic. That's making up for the intermittent state of the stream. Because it is all a bit odd. There we go, Paddington at the Cathedral, equaling out two apiece now. That won't be the last Cathedral we find. If we're lucky, we might find another tower as well. So excited for dinosaurs. Oh yeah, I think they're going to be cool. Don't drive in puddle, guys. Many deep pit holes causing accidents. Take it slow. Sage advice, that is. Imagine Chris gets a cue on the stream, cuts out. <laughs> you just see the cue be going, <laughs> and it freezes on that frame. Oop! Public libraries there. Very neat, but a very common one. And there's a Tiggy Winkle, our second Tiggy Winkle of the live stream. Hello Lighty Collects. Lighty Collects to the rescue. Battling through the storm. We're having a bit of technical difficulties. The storm is not helping. We've got Victory Cross Medals. Another common one. Are you in Lincolnshire? No, I'm not. I'm in Hampshire. Sailing smooth now. Fantastic. Fan Dabby Dozy. You went past the football? I don't think I did. There we go. Paddington at the Cathedral taking the lead. 3 2 to the Cathedral. Unbelievable. Uh, Jeremy Fisher. We have found more cathedrals than Benjamin Bunnies now. More cathedrals than Benjamin Bunnies. We've got representation of the people act there. Very cool. Oh dear, that's a bit battered, isn't it? <laughs> and there we go. Now we found double uh, the amount of Benjamin bunnies in Paddington's at cathedrals. Is anyone still Team Cathedral? Ironside there. Ironside. Oh, I hear thunder. That's a bit ominous. 
That's a bit ominous. Benji Bunny for the win. Exactly, coin cupboard. I watch in Finland, the stream looks fine for me. Shocking weather downstairs. I know, isn't it just lighty? I don't know whereabouts lighty you are, but um, where I am, it's pretty horrific. Can't spell the cathedral, so I'm team tower. <laughs> oh, that's good. That is good. When did you last find the Kew Gardens? September 2018. So it's been a while. It has been a while. So maybe that means I'm due one any day. That's how it works, right? That's how maths works. Somebody summon the weather gods. Make them see sense. They must not interrupt the live stream. Would you be happy if you get the IRB Battle of Britain? I will be over the moon. I will not just be happy. I will be dancing around like a lunatic. Because I've never, ever found one of them. I found two Kew Gardens, but never found an IRB Battle of Britain. Another Tiggy Winker. Wow. Plague of Hedgehogs today. Q has been bringing good money on eBay. Well, they're so desirable. Would you not have to ABBA if you found the IRB Battle Britain? No way, Jose. No ABBA to be played, thank you. When does this end? It's normally about, what, half eight? Between half eight and nine o'clock. It might overrun a little bit today because we've had some um, issues with the storm. Twenty fourteen again. Will you sell in any of your coins? Nope. Not interested in selling them. I'm a coin collector. Love to see British TV shows in a collection of fifty P's, only fools and horses, Cory, etc. Not bad it is. Why is Duck twice as expensive as Flopsy? But there are less Flopsies. Uh, I guess Puddle Duck has been in circulation much longer than the 2018s. So more of them have been taken out of circulation, whereas there's more, maybe more chance of finding a Flopsy Bunny or a Peter Rabbit because they're still fairly new. Oh, there we go. Battle of Britain, we've got our chance. We've got our chance. Luca, Luca Lo Leo. Hello. Uh, they're coming out of hibernation, says Master Temple. <laughs> what do we get? Is it going to be an IRB? Is it going to be an IRB? Nope. Just a JC, but still. A nice coin to find. Is Chris wearing a fez? Correct. I'd love to find a few guns in my chains, but it's never going to happen. So my husband bought me one for my birthday last year. But I still look for one in my chains. Definitely, Hannah. Definitely. Right. This is the last bag of 50 peas. Last bag of 50 peas. We've got dictionary. We've got a dictionary. Do I have an IRB in my collection? I do. The very kind uh, Total Coins sent me one to the PO box. So I do have one. But it is the ultimate goal is to find one. That would be awesome. This is the final bag of this bag, though. And that's it. We've got three Olympics. We won't sniff at that for, by any means. Roses are red. The fez was blue. It's Sunday night. We're waiting for Q. Amazing. <laughs> Roses are red. The fez was blue. 
It's Sunday night. We're waiting for Q. <laughs> I love it. Right, anything new? Anything new? Canoeing, boxing, aquatics. I think we've got all of them, haven't we? Canoeing, boxing, aquatics. We've already got. So, no, nothing new for the book, sadly. Oh, well, there's always next time. But we did get a grand total of three Olympics. So I won't be complaining about that because that is really, really good going. Lovely stuff. Just move some of these out of the way. And we'll get into the two pounds. I think I'll wash my hands after the two pounds. There aren't many two pound coins to get through. Why is Show Mary Hib saying P? What's been the best place to get a queue other than eBay? You can try the Facebook groups. JQ says, I found a queue at the post office the other day. It took about half an hour. <laughs> Very good. When's the next trip to the Mint? 7th of March, 1pm. Well, I think the 1pm is booked out now. I think it's all booked out now. Right. Two pound coins, what are we looking for in them? We are missing Commonwealth Games Scotland. That would be a nice find. We've got a whole page here, all of them. We are missing the World War One Navy Centenary with the error, which if we get everything else, I will call an end to this book. And there we go. So it's just Scotland Commonwealth Games that we're looking for then. Obviously, the, the uh, Navy Centenary error would be nice, but it's not a requirement to finish a, for the book to be finished, in my mind. Sherry Marie Hibbs says, I have Commonwealth Wales. What's it worth? Uh, again, I haven't found one for a long, long time, so I haven't looked at the sort of prices of them. That's a good start, though. We've got Charles Dickens, the old man and the animal. <laughs> I don't know if King Oris is around. I don't think so. Abolition of the slave trade. Another common one. And a Magna Carta. Holy Toledo, what is this going on with this bag? This is good. Magna Carta. I can't see any extra metal on it. So there we go. But that's a nice find. Very, very nice. And steam locomotive. Holy Toledo, four in the first bag. That's good going. That is good going. Hannah Smith got Magna Carta in change. Very nice. Found three Robert Burns, three Robert Burns Bible this week. Robert Burns Bible. Is that Robert Burns or is that the King James Bible? That is two coins you're mixing up there. Oh, the VE Day anniversary. St. Paul's. You see that a lot. You'll see that. Uh, you'll see this picture a lot on the 50p's at the moment. See, it's the most common 50p at the moment is um, <laughs> that cathedral. Do you reckon there's more or less than half a Kew Garden still in circulation? I wouldn't have the faintest idea. Hello, Absolute Coins. Thanks for tuning in. We're having a bit of technical problems with the weather. The weather is causing all sorts of connection issues. But, touch wood. It's been running smoothly for the last the last half of that last bag and this bag. How am I getting on with the world record? Going really good, thank you. Video will be up on Tuesday about that, so stay tuned for that. There we go, Robert Burns. Wowee. Very nice. We're having some good luck on the two pounds today, aren't we? Bearded Oracle. 
says, are you not concerned you may catch coronavirus from handling all this cash? No way. Not in the slightest. I'm invincible. I have nothing to con the coronavirus is nothing for me to concern myself about. Ooh. That'll be something. That'll be something. What do we reckon? What do we reckon? What do we reckon? Wind's pick picked up here in South End, says Katie Jones. Do you think they would change the shape of a two pound or a one pound coin? Not the one pound coin, because they've just changed that, but maybe a two pound coin. Skulls, history, army, Great Fire London, histories, comedies, army, comedies, tragedies, Commonwealth Games Scotland, don't think so. Comedies, histories, army, comedies, let's have a look. It is. The Army Centenary. Very nice. Shoulder to shoulder. He doesn't drink Corona. Strictly baby jam. <laughs> no. I drink purely cider. I can't drink anything stronger than that. I would be on the floor otherwise. Ah, oh, absolutely. Quince hasn't seen the new Fez, has he? We've got to show absolute coins the new fares. What do you think? And what colour is it? And no telling absolute coins what colour everyone else thinks it is. Don't you even drink vodka? No way, Jose. I haven't drunk vodka since I was in college. New fares? New fares. God, this thing is getting in my way, though. Just like that, <laughs> exactly. New Fez, you'd say it's midnight blue. Oh, dear. Absolute coins can't tell colours either. We've got another VE Day anniversary. But Nikki Yems can tell. Nikki Yems knows it's purple. Try not to joke about the coronavirus, please. Who's joking about it? Not me. Although, there was on the radio saying there's a 5% mortality rate, so I'm not quite sure what we're all getting so concerned about. Though you've probably run more risk of uh, dying in your car on the drive to work. Surely that's going to be more than 5%, right? We've got uh, wireless transmissions. Looks blue, says Darren Cheshire. Not blue, it's purple. This is blue, this is blue, and this is purple. Holy Toledo! Purpose the hat props. Uh, whilst I was on holiday in Tunisia last year, uh, Nikki Yems has just joined the hunt over on Twitch, thank you. Whilst I was on holiday in Tunisia, a viewer of mine, Frankie Frank, said if I didn't come back with a fez, he'd be disappointed. So I bought one. Um... <laughs> And I wore it on a live stream as a joke, and I got very, very lucky with it, so I just carried on wearing it. And I've just bought a new colour. Uh, we've got Brunel's portrait there. Is the t-shirt you're wearing blue? If so, that hat ain't purple. The shirt I'm wearing is also purple. Purple shirt, purple hat. A picture in purple. Chair is turquoise. <laughs> We've got a Britannia. We've got a chance then. Going to do any side inscription hunts. Edge hunting. We'll have a look after the, after this bag. We'll do the next one we will. Hashtag team, team blue shirts. <laughs> ah, I got a question. Absolute coins. Are you team? Have you come off the fence? Are you now team, team tower like uh, those of us that are going to win this competition? That shirt is blue. I guarantee this shirt is purple. You can bank on that. I've uh, got some guesses. 16, 15, 15, 15, 16, 16, 15, uh, 15, 16, 16. It is 
a 15. Very nice. So 15 is the lowest minted year out of the two. 16 is still a desirably low mintage. Um, 17 and 18 were not intended for circulation. I believe 2019 would be an NIFC as well. Beautiful Britannia is 15 is a bonus, exactly. There's what, 650,000 minted or something like that? Right, so let's have a look at the edge. I see something immediately. I see something immediately. Does everyone else see it? Oh, I think I see this one, the very front one as well. Another Britannia, wow. 2016, straight off the bat. Holy Toledo. But the one I spotted was this one. Now let me try and not give it away what the coin is. I'm going to have a peek. There, that's the queen side, this side. What do we reckon then? I think I know what it is. I think I know what that is. I like a new green towel. <laughs> no one else has noticed. I've, moved, I've flipped the towel as well. So this is the clean part of the towel. There's no big stain in the middle. <laughs> steam locomotive, steam locomotive. That's what I thought it was as well. It was steam locomotive. So there we go. Anything else though? Can we spot anything else? Oh, I see another one. Um, how am I going to get this to the front without giving away what it is? There we go. It says... It says something, but I can't read it. It says something, but I can't read it. I've got the faintest idea what that says. In victory. Goodness gracious. Mag. Magnum. Man, magnum. <laughs> I don't know what that word is. Magnamity. Namity? Magnamity? I'm. In peace. Good will. In victory. Someone type that word out. I haven't got the faintest idea what that says. Magnamity. Magnemonious, I've heard of. Magnamity. Mag. Magnamity. I think I've been looking at that word too long. I don't think it looks, it doesn't look like a real word to me now. In peace. Good will. Um, VE anniversary maybe in victory, magnanimity, magnanimity. Ooh, the comments are split. Trinity House, VE day, VE day, <laughs> VE day, St Paul's, Team Volcano, wheelchair darts, VE. <laughs> what is it? It is the VE day anniversary, that was what my guess was. Mag Mag Magma with plumes of magma. I think these are just all shoulders of giants left now. Well we found a couple there. Wasn't that good fun? Magnamity. Bungle nailed that one, did he? <laughs> I'd like to hear Bungle say magnamity. We've got another magnanimity at the cathedral. <laughs> what have you missed? Uh, not much, me mumbling, trying to say words. Ow. Hello, Sue. Christopher, I got a two pound from Cotswolds from year 2001. Looks like Egyptians on it. You got one sent in peer box a while back. Are they meant to be for circulation? Um, the, 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 the um, well, the two, the bimetallic one with like the Tutankhamun on it. We've got DNA double helix there. That's cool. Because the one with the Tutankhamun on it is an Egyptian pound. So not meant for circulation here, no. What's my favourite coin, KG Hull? Oh, it's got to be Magnamity at the Cathedral. Magnamity at the Cathedral. 
That's my new favourite coin. His magnanimity, the new Rodney. <laughs> in war, resolution. In defeat, defiance. In victory, magnanimity. In peace, goodwill. Winston Churchill. Ah, oh, really? Are these blue feathers for sale on my website? No, they sh they're not. They're not blue. They're purple. They're purple. Like, go look at Instagram. I posted a picture on Instagram. It is definitely purple. The word of the day is magnanimity. Now, everyone, you, we need to tr all fit the word magnanimity into the li into our daily lives tomorrow. And you can't just say, I watched some bumbling idiot on YouTube last night who couldn't say magnanimity. That is interesting. <laughs> My pet ant has coronavirus. Very good. Oop, we've got Guy Fawkes there. Very cool. But very common. We've got Magnamity again at the cathedral. I'm having a good stop. <laughs> yeah, although the purple fairies can tell you off at the Royal Mint next time. She'll bring a wooden spoon and you'll be running. Shout out, yeah, we'll do it on the next 10 P's. We'll do it on the next 10 P's. Magnamity Bunny. Uh oh, I've just seen the stream all go a bit for haywire. I've just seen the stream going all bit haywire. Oh, we had such a good run as well. Let's see if it settles down again. The only thing is you're saying it wrong. You, you, you spell it phonetically. You spell it phonetically. I've heard magnamony. I've heard magnamity. <laughs> so, <laughs> I don't know how to pronounce it. You spell it phonetically. Mag, oh goodness. Magnanimity, magnum, magnumonious. Yeah, I heard magnumonious, but mag. Last night I watched a film whilst drinking. A magnum in my tea. Magnum itty. Mag. Oh, I give up. <laughs> I give up. Magnamity. <laughs> uh. Magnamity. Magnamity. <laughs> I'm going to write it on the board. Let's talk about magnesium. Oh, gosh, you're just confusing me even more. Magnamity. Is that it? Magna, magnam, magnamity. Oh, I give up. I give up. All of these make-believe words. <laughs> Trying to confuse me. <laughs> magnamity. Magnum in mati. Magnum in. Oh dear, have we found my my Agatha Christie? Is, is that what we've done? We've got uh, the uh, Golden Guinea anniversary. That's a nice one. That's a keeper as well. Magnum. Mag. Mag. <laughs> Magnimity. Magnimity. Good evening, Christopher. My wife and me got a golden guinea, and my wife got me a golden guinea. Her change, awesome. We've got uh, the active union. I'm still laughing at magnanimity. What? <laughs> Hope you wash your hands before you eat. Definitely, hundred percent. I will wash my hands after these two pound coins. Magnum, magnum. Oh my goodness, I, I can't say it. I give up. Why do you want Magnum in your tea? I don't know. I don't know. 
<laughs> Ooh, we've got the King James Bible. Very nice. That's a keeper for sure as well. We're getting really good luck with the two pound coins tonight. Saturday, my family went to uh, Hunst Hunstanton and played the 10p push and got a silver 2p instead of 10p. Wow, very cool. Magnum for my tea. <laughs> Bungle can't even say Agatha Christie, Agatha Christie on screen. <laughs> I tried to get him to say it at the Royal Mint to be fair. <laughs> the thing is, I bet Bungle knows how to say Agatha Christie. I have no idea how to say Magnamity. <laughs> Magnamity sounds like, like hot diggity, or <laughs> it doesn't sound right. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. I keep thinking of that bloke in the X Men film. I feel like Officer Crabtree is what I feel like. I was busying Buzz the Wando. Will I have for tea? Uh, spaghetti bolognese. Can I have a man on my knee? <laughs> oh dear. Absolute coins, blue fairy. Oh dear, here we go. Manatees are sea cows. Manatees. Magnamities. Dangnamities. Manatees. Magnaminities. Who knows? <laughs> Your shirt is red. You need to adjust the little button, the dial on the side of your television. Is your T a magnum? Not the Magna Carta. The Magna Carta I know. Magnamity. Magnamity. Hot diggity. Manatees. Uh, did you see what the crowd was singing pre-match yesterday? Scotland versus England. It was my song. Nope. Did not see it. I've had to come so many times to stop it spinning. What do you mean? Magnanimous. Magnum. Magnumonious. Magnumonious. Holy. Mangamity. <laughs> Have you found any 20 pieces of that data on them yet? No, I haven't. Unfortunately not. Well, we got very, very lucky with the two pound coins there. Even if I did just about find my Krypton. My Kryptonite. Magnamity. I'm going to go wash my hands. I'm going to Google how you say Magnamity. <laughs> All right, we're back. We are back. Bungle, you should record songs for these intermissions. <laughs> oh dear. So I figured I had to say it. Are you ready? Magnanimity. There we go. I even put on a funny voice. But I figured it out. 
all by myself. <laughs> Magnanimity. 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 Magna. Magnanimity. Magnanimity. I give up. I give up. It's not a real word. That is uh, my conclusion. What does it mean? I haven't got the faintest idea. I don't even know how to say it, Dad Temple. <laughs> what am, how am I supposed to know? <laughs> what it means. Oh, I need some nicotine. Holy Toledo. Norfolk Coin Hunt. Oh, I shouldn't have said that. Norfolk Coin Hunt says good evening. I caught the end of your um, uh, live stream, which is quite cool. Flavor this week: Crystal Mist, Crystal Magnanimity. The virtue of being great of mind and heart. Uh, what tank do I use to vape? Panzer. We're all nutters, exactly. Magnanimity. Magnanimity. A million guesses I wouldn't have got that right. Anything good yet? We found lots of um, St. Paul's magnanimity, <laughs> magnanimity, magnanimity, magnanimity. Who knows? <laughs> magnanimity, mag, magna, magna, magma, magma, hot burning magma. Right. Enough of that insanity. You don't realise how on Discord later everyone would just be saying Magnamity. Magmonity. Magma. How's the wind? It's been horrific. It's been causing me problems with the stream as well. <laughs> For the love of God, it doesn't even sound like a word now. <laughs> Magmaminity. I don't know. <laughs> I think it's time to give up and move on swiftly past that one. Let sleeping dogs lie on that one, I think. I'm not going to be able to say it. We're all mad here. <laughs> it's official, Christopher's cracked up. <laughs> I was like this the first time with the Rodney Bannister. Oh dear, I can't even hold coins. You wait till the voice chat, you're going to get roasted. Oh well. It's fine. Everyone's got a word they can't pronounce. I knew someone that couldn't say Ferrari. Kept saying Fiari. What are the other ones that people can't say? Um... Millennium. Another one I've heard people failing to pronounce. Specific. Yeah, people say Pacific. You need to be more Pacific. <laughs> you need to be more Pacific with your pronunciation of magnanimity. All right, we're keeping half an eye out for any 2017s, just to wind Alex up a little bit. Spaghetti, Paschetti, there we go. Umbrella, can't say umbrella. Can't say orchestra, Paschetti. Turquoise, can't say most big words or spell them as I have dyslexia, there we go. Piedfoot, P-A-4, Piedfoot.
<laughs> Master Temple can't say no, I've had enough. Piss pronounce my worms. <laughs> Pierre Four. How'd you join the voice chat? So, uh, Discord. There is, I'm sure someone posted a link to Discord. Uh, you do have to be over 13 to be on Discord, though. And there's a section of it that's a voice chat that I always hang around in after the live streams whilst I'm looking through the coins for. Um... Oh, 2017. Pop that little growing pile of 2017s. Um, whilst I'm looking through the 50ps for the key dates. Christopher is broken. Maybe the storm is affecting him too. <laughs> oh dear. Can't say ammunition. Can't say super califragilist. Yep, that one. Off from boxing canoeing, what else have you found? Uh, we found a third Olympic, didn't we? Oh, I've no idea what it was. I can't get my head around magnanimity. <laughs> I'm from Clonelli. Colonel. Or is it Colonel? Colonel or Colonel. There we go, Alex. There's another one. Christopher finds a cue. Storm cuts the live stream. Hello, Hans Coins. How quick are you going through those coins? Oh, the 10p's. I go through so many. Keeping half an eye out for 2017s just to wind Alex on, on a Twitch up because he can't find one. Car park, I used to say park park. What was that one the other time? Flat caps. Flat caps. Flat caps or cat flaps? Try saying Aberystwyth. I went to go see Aberystwyth University actually. It was on my um, five choices of university. has got that clan fair pretty silly go go I can't say magnanimous whatever that is magnanimity <laughs> there's no way I'm saying clan fair pretty goody 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 can't say anything with the letter r in it I see I think Chris should stop vaping and start drinking energy drinks oh no I don't drink energy drinks I do not drink energy drinks. Other than coffee. Coffee's got energy and that's all the energy I need. It looks a bit odd, doesn't it? Must have been the light. Ooh! 2018! Hallelujah! The lucky purple fez has finally granted us a letter so which one reds things are going to get o x e w l you drink 24 red bull a day goodness gracious you better keep moving otherwise people are going to start chucking dirt on you if you're eating 24 of them but drinking 24 of them a day n k q m l d s p r n n n y f p c a a a t c c a f y f n j p p v c s p t c f l l l l v z p o e l e let's have a look it is letter letter n letter n yeah letter n n is a letter it's not a number is it goodness gracious what is up with me tonight a lovely lovely find and duvetto is not here Ah, so, well, I'll have, to, I'll have to tell Duvetto I found one of them. That's Duvetto's favourite. 
But there we go. Awesome stuff. Well, why am I feeling in the bag? We've already got one open. Dear, oh dear. It's all falling apart. It's all going horribly wrong. But it's fine. Chris thinks ends a number. <laughs> no, it's definitely a letter. I almost called it a number, though. How rare are the special 10p coins? They are exceedingly rare. We are lucky to find one or two in a hundred pound bag. But when you find it, that makes it all worth it. And they are stunning designs as well. But as I keep saying, the only way you'll never find something is if, if you give up looking for it. Number even starts with an N, does it? Yeah, very true. Very true. Who phoned Mr. Kipling? What? What? The storm's affecting my ability to talk properly. That is not just the storm. <laughs> I muddle my words anyway. We got 50 letters from the mint this morning. Holy Toledo. Good going. The hat. Did I see a similar hat in the movie Mummy? Uh, pass. It has been a long time since I watched The Mummy. I watched it one Christmas Eve when I was very young and was petrified. Absolutely petrified of it. But my childhood cat was a black cat, so the cat slept with me and I was fine. Because that was the one where the, the mummy was scared of cats or whatever he was. Uranus is tricky to pronounce on a family show. Can you say specifically what? S specificity? What? That's not a word. Specifically is. Lost Wi-Fi. Back now. I blame the Blue Storm Fez messing with your speech and the weather. Bring back Lucky Fez. How do you pronounce tuna? If you love Christopher Clex, click this link. Hmm. I want to know what's on that link. I want to know what's on that link. Specification. Say, magnimit, mag, oh, I can't even say it forwards. I'm never going to have a hope in hell of pronouncing it backwards. <laughs> His giveaway to Cheeky Sod. I, I told him he could plug his giveaway. I'm more than happy for Bunga to plug his giveaway. How close are you to 1500 subscribers, Bungle? You must be getting ratching on there very closely now. I don't know who you are, but your Fez is familiar. <laughs> There's no R in Latte. Specificity, specificity, meaning the quality or of belonging or relating uniquely, un uniquely, there we go, there's another one, uniquely to a particular subject. Right. Well, that made absolute sense to me. Specificity, specificity? Is it pet shout out time? Go for it. Go for it. 
We'll do pet shout outs. Who's got a pet that wants a shout out for their pet? As long as you've not got a pet called Holy Magnavity. Holy Toledo! <laughs> My cat Werther says Amber. There we go. Robert Roberts, uh, pet snail magnanimity. <laughs> Lucy, my dog, says Denise. Thank you, Lucy. That's a normal name. Um, Captain Becky and Jemima Puddle Duck. Shout out for... I have no idea what that means, but your squid. Well done. Soul Snake. What? Hi, Christopher. I'd like to go to the Royal Mint, but I don't drive. How easy is it to get there by train station? Uh, probably the best bet is to catch the train to Cardiff. And then onwards from there. Uh, Zotty Moon says four cats: Flump, Pearl, Poddy, and Clara. Uh, Harrison Oars Hamster Pippin. <laughs> Very good, Ashley. Pav the dog. Boris the chicken. Peter the rabbit. Millie my cat. Uh, used to have a pet hamster called Ginger, but she's gone. I'm sorry to hear that, Superstar Warrior. Christopher, uh, your dog. Choo Choo the Chupacabra. <laughs> Sir Poochington, says Lady M. Legendary hamsters, okay, thanks. Cheryl, says Millie the dog. Phoenix the snake, says the survivor. Uh, Amber Wakeling, says my puppy. No, you're not getting me on that one. Brunswick, the spotty ram. Matey, my dog. Tara. Uh, I'm sorry to hear that. It's not, it is not blue life. I'm sorry to hear that. But, but we've got Martin Ross with Bella the dog. Boo Boo the cat. Nala the cat has been reasonably good this week so she can have one too. Uh, we don't pronounce any words with the letter T up here into Yorkshire. <laughs> Fudge the cats. Duck Donald. Very good Bungle. Even Bungle's jumping on the um on the bandwagon with that one. Our cat is called Hello. A very good Bungle. <laughs> Binky, Amy Jane's dog. GSA Wolfcoin says, pet shout out for Max the Spider, the Speedra, and Lunatic the Cat, and mm, very good. Almost, you know, you're not going to get me. Roger the Puff Adder, Jerry and Loki says Katie Jones, Jeff the Crow says Mackenzie, Q My Garden, Patch the Rabbit, passed a week ago, I'm sorry to hear that. Hear that. Any more pets? Any more pets? <laughs> Very good. Uh, Sissian Z. Our fish is called Bungle. Only need 70 subs. Holy Toledo, you're getting there, aren't you? You know what? You can go on a timeout. I think one, two, three, four of us have just timed him out for 300 seconds. So we'll see you next, this time next year. <laughs> Rank Rabbit. Uh, Hans Quinn says a tortoise. Awesome. Uh, Ashley Sparrowhawk has another puffer fish named after a uh, automated machine answer a box thing. I don't know what you'd call them. The Rasta. The Ratster. My dog. Tom and Jerry the cats. Ada the calculator. Oh, very good. <laughs> Anything in the 10 P's? We've got the letter N. We got about two more 2017s just to wind you up as well, Alex. We're doing pet shout outs at the moment. Shout out to Red's uh, dog Bella, Andy the ant. We'll do one day, Hannah. Need to just find the time. Elsie mm. the Great Dane. There we go. I think we're done on pet shout outs. Chocolate the Yorkie. <laughs> Chocolate the Yorkie. Come on. Pull the other one. <laughs> that was a good one, though. I like that one. Used to have a guinea pig called. Mm, yeah. Christopher's fez is cool. My fish. Okay. Silly snake. Budgie called Freddy. He was named after Freddy Krueger, as he was a nightmare. <laughs> Amazing. Click here to see a picture of Christopher's dog. I don't think that's a picture of the dog. I think that is probably Bungle's giveaway. But click it nonetheless, because free coins is always good, isn't it? If you haven't entered Bungle's giveaway and subscribed. For the love of God, please do it. He only needs 70 more, and then he'll stop talking about it. 
Bungle the Bear, says Master Temple. One more pet out, pet shout out from Total Coins. Bungle the Coin Tuber. Very good. Shout out to my pet bear Bungle. Ghost to my dog is called Leah? Lia? Lia? Ooh, what is that? That looks like it's Hong Kong to me. That's a stunning design though, isn't it? Thanks for the shout out. She's now in heaven with Home of the Great Dane. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Do you take your change out of Lloyd's? Nope, I pay it into Lloyd's though. You can toucan, cat is called buttons. Very cool. What's it gonna be? Oh no, it's Chinese. One Yuan, 2018. Ooh, that's a new one as well. That's a neat, uh, neat find. A neat find. That's a neat coin and find. Rolled into one noise. I like that coin. Yeah, it's kind of neat, isn't it? Kind of neat. Disinfect that coin. <laughs> oh, dear Lord. We'll put that one in quarantine, shall we? We'll send it to Milton Keynes. <coughs> keep your phones away. Keep your phones and your TVs and your everything's away from your face in case you download it. Get that coin tested. <laughs> Would you please give a shout out to my pet Richard? There we go. You're doing a great job keeping me entertained whilst I wait for a you to have her lambs. Wow. Cortana. My dog is Floyd after Pink Floyd. That's a cool name. Very cool. Holy Toledo. Holy Toledo. We've got a few. Oh, I missed a bunch of follows on Twitch. I'm sorry. I apologise. Let's have a look. Who have I missed? Who have I missed? I've missed... Uh, Dugu Peg has joined the hunt. So is Is Not Blue Life. And Neven Brad is hosting my stream with a viewer. Thank you very much. I've got an itch on my face, but I can't scratch it because I've just touched that coin. So bear with me. Uh, please shout out my Jack Russell Bindi. She's 14 years old. Holy Toledo, that is good going for a, for a dog, isn't it? If you have coronavirus, does that mean you've been drinking lots of corona drinks? I think so. Whoops. Terry dear. <laughs> I think everyone's a little bit obsessed with that Chinese coin. Oh, there we go, Alex. Another 2017 for you. How's that? I've got so many of them there. They're all falling over. Oh, that looks odd, doesn't it? Is it just me that looks Holy odd? Holy Toledo! <laughs> uh, Tom07x has hosted me with a viewer as well. Thank you very much. I did look odd. 
It didn't look like the Queen for a moment there. It's a lovely ring. Where did you get it? Uh, it, was, it was supposed to be free in like a part work, but I had to pay a ten pound ten pound import fee. So I thought if I'm paying for it, I'm wearing it. I've worn it ever since. But no, it's just a normal ten p. We're going to keep that one to the side there because it looked really odd. I thought we had something interesting there. I guess from a certain point of view, it is like a pharaoh. Did I see Norfolk Coin Hunts Elites talking about his giveaway? I think is it when you get is it hundred hundred and fifty subscribers? You've got a giveaway as well. Lots and lots of giveaways going on. Uh, she looks like she has a bald head. <laughs> <laughs> Bizarre. Kappa plays four four five says, "Can you give me a shout out? I've been collecting for years." There you go. Daniel Miller, you keep that up, and you'll find yourself unable to speak. Alex is missing 2017. Oh, yeah, sorry. Those of you that didn't see the start, Alex over on Twitch can't find a 2017 10p. So I'm keeping half an eye out for them just just to, as a bit of a wind up because he normally winds me up on the streams. So, bit of payback. Master Temple will give a painting away if I find if I find a Q, as in Q Gardens. Well, I think my chance of finding Q Gardens in the ten Ps are pretty slim to none. Have you done fifty Ps yet? I've done one bag. We've got one more bag to go on the fifty Ps though, so we will be back on the fifty Ps after these ten Ps. There's a Q ten P count. Last last master temple on that one. You'll have to ask master temple on that one. A two seventeen ten piece rare. I don't think so, but Alex can't find one. So well, there we go. There's another one. 2017. Ding, ding, ding. Winner, winner. What have you found so far? We found the letter N. We found Chinese one Yuan. And we found this funny little splodge on that one there. Last chance when Christopher collects blue fares. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I think that's Bungle trying to trick people. Bungle trying to get people over to his giveaway, but go um, over to his giveaway. Quicker he gets 1,500 subscribers, quicker he will stop talking about it and will give away those awesome coins. It's a very generous giveaway, to be fair. A very, very generous giveaway that any coin collector would want to be a part of. Handy bags, I forgot one, two, three, four, five, ten peas. And then we've got a bag of 50 peas to round it all off. I'm a big fan and think you have noticed because I always comment on your videos first. So thank you. I do read through all the comments that get posted. I, I don't have the time to reply to everyone anymore. That would be a task in, a, in, a, in as... That would be a task. <laughs> How rare are these to get? They are exceedingly rare. Oh, Alex is putting pennies from the year 2000 down the drain for every 2017 Tempe, I find. Bungle sees he's got a vape giveaway. <laughs> Amazing. 
Anything for views, right, Bungo? <laughs> Two hundred and thirty-six watching. Go give Bungle collects coins the subs he needs. Exactly. Bungle has no shame. Bungle will talk about it until the end of the live stream every three minutes if you don't go over and subscribe. So I implore you. I demand of you. I'm gonna go wash my hands after this bag. There we go, Alex. There's another one. Right. Oh, there's another one, Alex. Whoops. Hot bungle one coin deed is plenty. <laughs> if you get free coins, you'll get free coins. Bungle's got an awesome giveaway going. Get on over there. Get on over there. Out of all four Paddingtons, which is your favourite design? Uh, it has to be Paddington at the station. I'm doing a strike here in 2020 Britannia for my 500. Um, love if anyone's interested sneaky plug if you don't mind no live streams are more than happy to give everyone a plug that's a nice giveaway though 2020 britannia strike your own holy toledo watching christopher live every sunday has become a welcome part of my week oh, thank you that's very kind of you to say alex blonde is drinking his sorrows away in a copper bag oh dear oh dear oh dear oh dear Best coin ever, Frankenstein, two pound, hands down. Best coin ever. And four cases of coronavirus reported in the UK. Mm. Jumper. Moderators, if Daniel Miller steps out of line again, just hide him from the channel. I think that's the second time he's been timed out. Last bag of 10 peas. Last bag of 10 peas. What have we found? We found N for NHS. We found this one that's got a funny splodge on it. And we found, whoa, dear, 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 dear. We found that Chinese coin, which is pretty cool. Do you ever search One Piece? Is there any good One Piece? I do, but because I'm trying to work towards a world record, I'm trying to get the most penny, uh, the most coins from the year 2000. 
So I'm, I hunt through about 40 pounds of pennies every week, fishing them out, and then I update it once a month. No 2017s in here. Just for that, Alex, we're going to check every single last one of them to make sure. Right, concentrate. Oh, 2016, that's close. Should we check the dates? We don't need to check the check the designs. That's not gonna be one, is it? Come on, 2017. I have a good feeling about this. Nope. NHS and the Chinese coin. Ah, oh, that's a good idea. We'll just the Chinese coin. We'll just stick that under the NHS one, and it'll protect me. Sorry, I am focusing. I'm concentrating. Nope, there was no 2017s in that, and no alphabets. But there we go. We did get one, letter N, from 2018. Is that a new one for the book? N, 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 N. Nope, we've already got that one. So that is another cool spare. But there we go. We can find them, but I am going to go wash my hands, because they are looking pretty gross now. So I should be back in a moment. And we're back. We are back. <laughs> I've got to wash my hands. Look, see? All better. All better. All gone. No deadly diseases on my hands now. If you could change the rarest 50p, would you keep it as Q or change it? I put it to Benjamin Bunny just for the laughs. Why not? Fez change, there we go. Fez Master General reporting in. <laughs> Do you use swarf? Swarf? I don't know what that means. I don't know what that is. Don't vape, kids, yes. Don't vape, don't smoke, don't eat white bread. Um, don't put coins in your mouth. Don't cross roads. Stay inside, in your bubble wrap. Don't eat yellow snow. Don't make eye contact whilst eating a banana. What Muppet would you like to see on a coin? Beaker. Beaker's my favourite Muppet. If you could be a duck or a goose for one day, what would you be and what would I do? I'd be a goose and I'd attack everyone I guess I met. How do you guys know if he does? If I do what? I believe the Vez could change the weather. Could you imagine that? Any other 
Uh, advice for anyone? Industrial soap used in industry to remove oils. There we go. Oh, Swarfega is an industrial hand soap. That's not a bad idea, actually. Not a bad idea. I'll have a look on Amazon, see what I can get. Any other hints and tips for life? We've got to eat yellow snow. Don't vape. Don't cross the road. Don't eat white bread. Fun fact, the Swedish chef is called the Norwegian chef in Sweden. <laughs> really? I made a hand wash for small people dwarf figure oh, for crying out loud. <laughs> that was awful. <laughs> Don't look at the sun. Very good advice, Harrison. Very good advice from Harrison there. Best life tip, subscribe to Bungle. There we go. Go subscribe to Bungle. How many subscribers are you off now, Bungle? We must be almost there. Don't sit on barbed wire fences in Bermuda shorts. Magnanimity. <laughs> Nailed it. <laughs> Hello everyone from Houston, Texas Says She Pirate Hello to you Don't stick a knife in a socket Good advice Sage advice as well Don't tie your shoelaces in revolving doors <laughs> Don't swim after food Don't look at the sun Don't tie your shoes in rotating doors That's my favourite so far Survive the demo court. I don't know what what they are. You should try. Oh, I can't see that. Come on. Oh, come on. Oh, there we go. Someone beat me to it. You should try sorting coins whilst wearing those white snooker referee gloves just to see how comically filthy they get. I can only imagine. Is this a rainbow appreciation channel? Am I am I lost? Well. Bungle is Bungle collects coins. Um, and he's got his own channel, and he comes into don't pee into the wind, <laughs> don't fall off the edge of the earth. I cried out loud. Never sandpaper. Oh dear. My advice: eat white bread only. Don't eat raw chicken. Don't overload a socket. Don't fight ninjas. Don't touch dirty door handles. There we go. Tons and tons of advice from everyone. Don't eat yellow snow. Don't take a laxative before going to bed. Good advice, good advice. Right, I think we're going to get into the last bag of 50 peas. Don't shop on Wish. <laughs> Where'd you get a catalogue of 50 pences? My advice would be go over to Change Checker and check their app. I use it all the time. Don't leave a union you reply on. <sighs> political, political. Don't get married and have four boys. <laughs> oh dear. Denise sounds quite outnumbered. Come on, let's get a queue. Exactly, exactly. Well, there we go. That was bound to happen. Paddington at the Magnemonius. Of course we were going to find that one. Q is coming. Let's cross our fingers. Never write down anything you don't want the world to know. Best advice. There we go. If you are Team Tower, click there. Oh, I don't know. I don't know if you're going to get the Team Tower. Team Tower to join you, Bungle. Oh, there's another one. Paddington the Magnemonious again. Magnemacity, Magnemoniousity, whatever you want to call it. And a People Act. Jeremy Fisher from 2017. Holy Toledo. Uh, Neo XR has joined the hunt. Thank you very, very much.
Chris doesn't understand. When I went through my 50p patterns on Friday, had three times as many towers as cathedrals. Wow, hey, coin pick. That's good luck, isn't it? Whoops. Coin pick then. Coin pick. What team are you on? Are you team tower or team cathedral? Padded to the memory. <laughs> QQQ, hashtag Team Tower, Team Cathedral. Anyone else watching from Hemel Hempstead? Ah, uh, coin pig smelling of creosote sat on that fence. We've got a people act. Oops. Ooh, we got Olympic. Olympic tennis. Holy Toledo. That is a good find. Froze Vulcan is team hashtag broke. <laughs> if Bungle gets to 1500 subs tonight, he will switch to team tower. Man, that is, that is persuasion. That is plenty to be persuaded. Although you, all your team cathedral viewers might just switch off Bungle. <laughs> Bungle is bluffing. Mm. There's another Paddington at the Magnamity. Which far sides for subs. <laughs> See, anything for views, anything for views. Team Tower. I think we should start calling it Team Tower and Team Magnanimity. Magnum, Magnum, whatever that stupid word was. Paddington at the Magnanimity again. Now see, I think Bungle wants to be on Team Tower and this is just an excuse for him to be able to bow out of Team Magnimity. Team Cathedral moved to remove Bungle from the team due to his lack of faith. Paddington, whatever that stupid word was, has a lovely ring to it. <laughs> oh dear, we've got a Benjamin Binney there. First of many. First of many, I'm sure. Bungle's a traitor. Traitor. What design would I like to see in 50 piece? I've said time and time again, I would love to see the, U the counties of the UK across a whole set of coins. Designed by people that live in those counties. So if that happens, what design would you like to have on your county? I think living in Hampshire, it's got to be Jane Austen for me. What 
what's going on in everyone else's county coins. Fake tan for Essex. <laughs> Any coin should be going to the Mint at all soon? I think we're all going March 7th. Nelson? Yeah? Robin Hood says Purple Fairy. Flat caps for Yorkshire. Orkney needs something stormy. <laughs> Smeaton's Tower for Devon. I've never been to Cheshire, no. Rain and knife crime for Dorset. Amazing. South Yorkshire would have to be the steel industry. Lewes Castle for East Sussex. Purple pennies. West Yorkshire pine peas. That would be Jane Austen. There's already a Jane Austen two pound coin. Possibly, but I think that's what Hampshire is possibly most famous for. 2003, I thought it was 2008 then. We've got Jeremy Fisher. Viking wearing a flat cap, riding a whippet for Yorkshire. <laughs> Amazing. We've got Dictionary there. YouTube chat is crazy. It is pretty bonkers over there. I think it's all the magnanimity in the, in the air that's causing it. Found a King James Bible from the bank yesterday. Wowee, nice find. Nottinghamshire, fish and chips. Master Tim says the coal mines. Can your streams just not end? Uh, unfortunately, they do have to end. In fact, we're normally finishing up about now. But due to the weather, we're over and running a little bit. Victoria Cross, heroic act there. Another Benjamin Binney. Followed by another Benjamin Binney. Do a live stream of the car journey to the Royal Mint. I'm not sure how exciting that would be, if I'm honest. Oh, I see a dictionary. Taylor Peter Rabbit, just missing old Crazy Eyes Tom Kitson now from the 2017 set. If you found a cue in the stream, would you not be able to put it in your video bit? Correct, it would go in the live stream book. I have dictionary worth much, uh, only face value, sorry. It's a very, very common one to find. Holy Toledo. Uh, Vukan has now joined the hunt over on Twitch. Thank you very, very much. Christopher never checks for the pokey hat error. Nah. Harrison Orr is hosting the stream again with a viewer, thank you. There might be in the queue in this bag. Holy Toledo. There might be a queue in this bag according to Mr. Absorbency. Who knows? Got as much chance of it being in this bag as any other bag. Sadly not though. Can I go to the Royal Mint on June 3rd? Maybe. It depends. Uh, if the strike going changes, we could end up going there. Depends on my rotor at work. What day of the week it is. Obviously I can only go weekends really. A coin big video just dropped, did it really? We 
got Christopher inside there. Cool design, but very common. Victoria Cross, heroic acts. So do we know what the next strike hero is going to be? Rumour has it. Rumour has it. It's going to be the VE Day Anniversary £2 coin. Pretty cool. That's changing fairly shortly as well to that. Holy Toledo. Uh, C. Grunter has joined the hunt over on Twitch. Thank you very, very much. Victoria Cross, medals there. Another common one. Another iron side. Lovely. Um, UH Gamer says, Can I have some rare coins? Well, go over, subscribe to Bungle, join his giveaway. You may just get yourself some. Paddington at the magnanimity. Oh, there we go. We've got Flopsy Bunny in the last Fidgety bag. We've got Peter Rabbit. Not quite the rarest uh, Beatrix product from 2018. Alphabetically. Take second place. Oh, I'm putting him down there for. Did I hear about the YouTube who faked his girl's death? I think I saw on the BBC News about that, yeah. Oh, holy Toledo. We've got another Olympic. Olympic handball. What a start to this bag. Two Olympics. Wow, we, we've got three in the last bag. We're on our second one this bag. Bungle is 50 subscribers off. Holy Toledo, you've done well tonight, Bungle. Whoa. For your sins, Bungle, next week you've got to plug coins to collect. As much as you plugged your giveaway this week. How's that for a deal? There's Girl Guides, another common one, but it's a cool design. Isn't the 2017 Shield rarer than Puddle Duck? Uh, off the top of my head, I think it might be. Never win a giveaway. Well, the never way, the only way you'll never find, you'll never win a giveaway is if you never enter them. So head on over to Bungle and enter his giveaway. For the love of God, and those giveaways, so he's. <laughs> Another 2018 there. What's going to be? Another Taylor Gloucester. Wow, that's the fourth Taylor Gloucester tonight. We've got the winner, Paddington at the Tower. Very nice. Very good, Jamesy. I think we need to have a massive, massive plug for total coins, definitely. We've got Team GB there. Another common one. Which we're getting a new Team GB one this year. What camera do I use to make the videos? I've got a Canon EOS 80D. It is that one. Da, 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 da.
Congratulations on 40,000 subscribers. Thank you very, very much, Mr. Absorbency. Victory Cross, Heroic Acts, pull out of the other ones we found. That finger, I know. Coins are disgusting. Don't worry, I will wash my hands. Holy Toledo! Uh, yes, I fold pre. Has joined the hunt. Thank you very, very much. Interesting name. Favorite fifty p. Isaac Newton. 100%. About time the coin pig had lunch. <laughs> Poke time. Ah. Oh. Falling before the flop. We've got, that's the Paddington we want to see, Paddington at the tower. Lovely stuff. We've got two bags after this one, and we are donezo for tonight. Oops. Twenty seventeen's Peter Rabbit. Forty-five subscribers to go for Bungle Collect. Wow, we you certainly are getting there. Q's worth hundred pounds, a bit more than that as well, and the rest. Do I ever go for the foreign coins? Yes, every Sunday I have a, a world coin hunt, so I did one today. I mix it up sometimes. I do a tra coins, uh, treasures from the PA box. So that's going through all the awesome coins that've been sent in to my PA box. They take a bit longer to edit, so depends how much time I have on my hands. Kid collects coins, says I found a Q Garden so to be, then I woke up. Oh dear. Right, we are all of a sudden onto the very last bag of the very last bag of the live stream. But for those of you that have been watching this far into the live stream, a big thank you. Um, you may be interested to know I have a Discord server. You can click the link down in the description to go and join that. <laughs> We've got Paddington at the Magnemonious. Magnemanity. Magnemanity. Um, if you're over the age of 13, I'll be on my Discord server this evening, hunting through those coins off to the side to see if we've got any of the key dates. So if you're around and you want to have a chat with us all, feel free to come over to that. We've got Roger Bannister in that bag. And a Sherlock Holmes. Very cool. Miss Jiggy Winkle as well. So that is a busy bag, isn't it? Wow we. And another dictionary. There we go. Wow we. I'm gonna have a one quick spy through the book to see if any of those are new. I don't know if handball or tennis might be. Handball or tennis might be. That's two pounds, I'm not gonna find them in there. No, that's not going to be, is it? 
and Bourne Tennis are not. Sadly, nothing new for the book, but to find two Olympics is pretty awesome going, isn't it? So I'm chuffed to bits with that. So we'll end the, the, the live stream on Twitch first. So who have we still got on Twitch? We've still got Yes I Fold Bree, we've still got Total Coins, Alex Blondin, Reds, Martin Ross, Gollum Guy, uh, Alex Blondin, Alex Blondin, Amber Wakeling, Master Temple, uh, Sea Grunter, what a name, what a name, Martin Ross, Lynn Mills, anyone else? Total Coins will be about. So those of you on Twitch, let's get a raid set up. Don't you worry, people on YouTube. I'm not. I've not forgotten you. We will be back to say goodbye to those of you on YouTube momentarily. Oh, whoops! I pressed the button. We go for cooking with Kate. Who else is over on Twitch? We've got Chucky Garden, Martin Ross. Thank you very much for watching. I hope that you've enjoyed, and I'll see you next time for more magnanimous live streams. Bye. Who's on Twitch then? Uh, Twitch, we've on Twitch. Who's on YouTube then? We have got Bungle Collects Coins, uh, Jerry, Mac, Ryan, Davies, Lee, Brockbank, uh, Janet Smith, Coins to Collect, Tech Girl, Dylan Deacon, Robert Roberts, Shuey08, Tech Girl, Robert Roberts, Norfolk Coin Hunt, Elite. Uh, well, not Elite, we're just Norfolk Coin Hunt. Uh, Snapdragon, very good Justin, he almost got me. Uh, Official Gamer, Superstar Warrior, Coins to Collect, uh, Kraken Master, Addo Buzz, uh, Denise Haynes, Girl Power, Dylan Quarterly, Goblin Nook, Dutch Spotted, uh, Victoria Teasdale, Coins and More UK, Jim Kids and More, uh, Sound of Philadelphia, HMS Belfast, Dylan, Ryan Davies, Amy, World War II History Buff, Nathan the Killer, <laughs> Stuart Brown, Coin Digging, Ambo Aikling, Janet Smith, Darren Coles, Legendary Hamster, Owen Dawkins, Ryan Davies, Dragon Collects, Purple Fairy, Gushy, Andrew Herring, Matt Thomas, Bed Bug, Gushy, Official Gamer, Adam Boots, Christopher Nutter, uh, <laughs> Steve Wendes, Wendes um, Purple Fairy, Coins to Collect, Sue D, David, uh, Dave Matthews, Matthew T, Spike Lawrence, Mackenzie, Avriola, uh, Amy Jane, Katie Jones, Steve Ufton, Michelle Delicia, uh, Tom Potter, Jamesy B. Hoy, Jamesy B. Hoy, Jamesy Boy, Sarah Doak, Andrew Green, Official Gamer, Unconventional Marathon Marathon Runner, did Bungle do it? I think he's 45 subscribers off. So a massive thank you to you. I hope that you've enjoyed, and I'll see you next time for more.